and welcome to a Toby Knits Vlogmas Day 15! Day 15! <clears throat> and when you watch this, I'll be in Nova Scotia ah, with my Sean and Megan and Leo. Um, yeah, so yesterday you saw me packing and getting ready to leave and um, I wanted to quickly talk to you today about what I'm taking with me knitting wise. But first let's open the advents. <clears throat> so this is my uh, Craft House Magic Mixtape Minis Advent I made myself and I packaged all the minis from I collected over the year and then Bob um, put the numbers on the bags for me so I don't know what's in what bag and today we have oh I bet you this is from the July the peach isn't that gorgeous let's see I bet it's the July Oh, when I was right. Oh, buy a lottery ticket in. Buy a lottery ticket in. Everybody wants to rule the world. Oh, tears for fears. Everybody wants to rule the world. Let's figure it out. It goes. <laughs> but I do remember that. Now, funny story. I used to live in Bath in England. I went to college there. Bath Technical College, and um, and I got a little flat. It was the first time I got a flat. I was eighteen. Got a flat uh, that I had in up just up past the circle, uh, in those beautiful big old Edwardian houses, maybe I think. Anyway, um, beautiful, beautiful uh, apartment flat, flat on the top floor, and I shared it with another girl. Anyway, one night I was walking home. It's probably early in the morning, really. Um, I was walking home and um, the roads were all deserted because it was like, I don't know, o'clock in the morning. And um, I was walking up this one uh, road and one car comes down and I'm literally, I'm crossing. So, and you know, my husband gets mad because he says to me, why do people, when they cross the road, go diagonally across the road? Why don't they just not cross from side to side? Why do they have to go all the way across and take so long to get there that cars have to wait? I don't know, but I probably did that. So I was crossing the road and um, this one sports car was coming down the road. And of course, maybe he didn't like the diagonal thing. I don't know. But anyway, he started driving towards me towards me now he wasn't going fast and I was not gonna get out of the way um and then as he walked past he waved so I waved back and it was the guy from Tears for Fears yeah it was the lead singer who knew yeah anyway that was my claim to fame so uh that's fabulous thank you Ellie I love that color and the other thing is our quilting subscription that I got. No, it's not a subscription. I must matter with you. I'm so kerfuffled today because I'm about to fly and I don't like flying. Oh, this feels a funny shape. This is a funny shape altogether. It's like a notepad. One of them fancy notepads. Okay, well anyway, this is from... <laughs> I hope this makes total sense to you when you're watching this. This is from Water Girl Quilt Co, which is my local quilting shop in Prescott, Ontario, and I purchased their advent this year. I've never had a quilting advent before, so. Oh, oh. I've never done paper piecing, and I've always wanted to try it. <gasps> oh, it's it's one inch hexagons with a hundred pieces inside. Oh my goodness. Oh, I wonder what we're going to do with them. How exciting. Okay, I'm off out now. I'm going to have one last cup of coffee with a friend in the village at the Bean. And, uh, and then I'll be off to the airport. So, um, uh, yeah. See you tomorrow. Oh, no, 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 no. What's wrong with me? There's something wrong with me. I am just really not. <laughs> I hope you didn't click off. <laughs> I was going to show you what I was taking and what I wasn't taking. Okay, so I'm taking the socks because these are little. And I can do these on the plane. 
and so the socks are coming with me and I just started having ripped out by the look of it my colors in my excitement one moment please there oh um, I just started on the row of this these two two rows here which give us the uh, little bumpy things so that's where I am so I'm taking these with me so these will be coming these are the fantastic pattern by the way um, I'm here for the food from Dana Ray makes she's Canadian and I'm also taking with me which I think that will fit in that so that's my plan this is the advent that I'm using all those mixtape minis for, and this is from Ellie of Craft House Magic, which is where the mixtape mini tapes uh, thingies came from. And this is her look. Oh my, look at this one. Oh, this is her um, uh, sound wave cow. I couldn't think of the name. This is her sound wave cowl. So it started here and I'm going to put 10 or 12. So currently, and it goes this way around your neck. So currently I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm either gonna add four more or six more. I'm so good at math. Does that not just blow your mind how good I am at math? I mean, and I produced a CPA. I did. I did. Thank God. <laughs> so anyway, I absolutely adore this. It's a fabulous pattern. It's super easy. Although we're stitching it this way, it will go that way. And it's called the sound wave. So I'm taking this with me because, oh, and this is the new color. I'm just about to put on. Look at that. It's going to go with these two colors. Oh. Um, so that's going to go with me because I feel like, yes, look at this. And that's going on my carry-on. So that's coming with me. But I'm not going to take this gorgeous, gorgeous, because I just can't fit all these in my bag. So this will stay at home and I'll have to catch up when I get home. Because the plan would be that that cowl will be finished by the time I get home. Wouldn't that be cool? And then when I'm home, I'll just finish the stocking. Now, here's where I'm up to with the stocking. And here is the newest piece we got yesterday. Isn't that gorgeous? Now, then they're meant to be trees. To me, they look like space invaders. <laughs> Do you remember that game that you used to get in pubs? I don't even know if you got it over here, but these are space invaders. So I think they don't look like trees to me. But aren't they cute but they're meant to be treats so it's coming on really good it's gonna be big i think i hope tomorrow we start on the heel because it's a big stocking i don't even think i have a regular stocking this big i might have to line it though because we've got all these floats and things i might line it with um some beautiful fabric Anyway, so I'm not taking this because it's just too big. The yarns are big and so that's not coming. So there you go. Now I really have finished. Now I really have finished and I'm going to go and have a cup of tea with my friend. And calm down. <sighs> Namaste. I don't even know what that means, but whatever. Okay, so... <laughs> I know I say it at the yogurt, but whatever. It's supposed to calm you, isn't it? I don't know. Anyway, I'm waffling. I'm going. Okay, bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Bye.